What's up guys, I'm Random Frank P, back with episode 34 now of Room Tour Project, the series we show off the best gaming setups. This episode's gonna have a special theme to it, single monitors only. Hope you guys like it, got some really awesome setups planned here. Maybe from here on out we'll pick themes for each week or something like that, maybe once a month. I don't know, I just wanted to try it out, but I think you'll like it. So let's kick it off with episode 34. First up is a nice looking, simple setup that has a nice approach of doing the most of what you got. All his gear is right at arm's reach, including the PC nicely tucked behind the monitor. Speaking of which, that monitor is the Acer X34, the 100Hz G-Sync gaming monitor, and I like its floating appearance with it being mounted very nicely. Getting into the rest of the gear on the desk, here's the Focusrite Sapphire audio interface with PSB Image 2B speakers and a pair of Pioneer HDJ 2000 headphones. His keyboard is the Gigabyte Avia with brown switches inside, and the mouse is the Rock Hat Cone XTD. Now let's get into his PC. In the Thermaltake V31 core case is an Intel 2600K, 60 gigabytes of RAM, and a Zotac 980 Ti graphics card. All liquid cooled, of course. But altogether, very nice. I like the practical layout of the setup, and he really takes advantage of having that ultra wide monitor mounted. Now, this setup is really unique, and at first glance, it might not seem like it, but I really dig what he did with this. We have another Acer X34 monitor here, a Space Mouse Pro, which is a 3D mouse, the SteelSeries Apex M800 keyboard, and the SteelSeries Sensei mouse, all on this beautifully wooden desk. But where the real magic comes in is in that PC he has over there. That custom water-cooled PC is a beast. In the modded Hexgear R40 case, he's rocking the i7-5960X CPU on a Gigabyte X99A gaming micro motherboard, 32 gigabytes of DDR4 Corsair Dominator Platinum RAM, and two Asus GTX 980Ti's in SLI. But what really makes it unique is the layout of that PC its beautiful aesthetics and how well it's made and put together, and of course that custom water cooling job inside is one of a kind. I love this one here, it is just all together looking really awesome. This guy definitely knows what's up and knows how to make a killer setup as chill as this. For this one, when I saw the white and black theme with the H440, I said, all right, you got me. But no, really, this one is very minimalistic, and I like the addition of the white Stormtrooper little action figure there to complement your theme with the white Xbox One controller in the corner as well. His monitor is the LG 34UM95P, a nice 34-inch ultra-wide monitor from LG, a popular choice. He's also using the Corsair Gaming K95 RGB keyboard and the Razer Naga Epic Chroma mouse as his weapons of choice for gaming. Now into that PC, very nice and neat and the aesthetics are on point with all matching white and black hardware. He has an i7-4790K, some Corsair cooling with the G100i GTX cooler, 16GB of white HyperX RAM, and an EVGA GTX 980Ti graphics card. And to also add to the color, inside of his case he has an NZXT Q Plus for some extra LED lighting effects as well. Altogether very nice, the theme is very similar to mine, so of course I'm going to like it. And I'm thinking of picking out my own little Stormtrooper action figure actually as well. And points for the cleanliness. Whoop, following it up is another Stormtrooper spotting. I actually see two separate ones here, but this is really cool. Uh, this one has a very nice, cozy, and warm look to it due to the LED lights behind the desk. Got the guitar there off to the side, some beige drapes, and the window right there. This one has a very unique look, and I feel like I would be extremely comfortable and content if I had to sit at this one every day. Plus one for the plants too. His monitor is the Dell 2713HM, a 2560x1440p resolution monitor. On the desk for his peripherals, he has the CM Storm Quickfire Rapid Keyboard, a Myonix Caster Mouse there on a Zowie Mouse Bungie, and his speakers in the corner are the Audio Engine A5 Plus. Oh, by the way, I get a lot of requests to include desk in the uh, description, so I'll drop his desk down there so you guys can check it out. Inside the Corsair 780T case, which is custom painted yellow to match his theme, he has an i7-4790K on an ASRock Z97 Extreme 4 motherboard, the Corsair GTX H100i liquid cooler to keep them temps down, and the MSI Lightning 980Ti graphics card, and I see the HyperX Cloud headset there. Like I said, really, really great setup. I love the look of everything here, and I highly approve it. 
Okay, and the flow continues into another warm and cozy setup. It's almost as if I planned that or something. This bedroom setup absolutely nails it here with the warm lighting, the bright desk, and some extra plants and sculpture figures to give this a lot of personality. With that Acer X34 1CK monitor, gives him tons of real estate, and that wallpaper is something. For the peripherals, we have the Corsair Vengeance K70 with MX Red switches, the Razer Death Adder Chroma mouse on a Razer Firefly mouse pad, and a HyperX Cloud gaming headset. Very nice choices. And you can see in the corner the red and black themed PC. Inside is an Intel i5 4690K with Corsair H100i GT cooling again, 16GB of Corsair Vengeance RAM, and the XFX R9 Fury X GPU. Underneath the desk, we do have some LED lights for backlighting, which will ultimately add to the room's feng shui. Yep, definitely a nice bedroom setup here. Good vibes, good vibes. Then we have a similar looking one here, but the shades are open this time, giving the room a much more natural lighting look, opposed to the last setup's warm feel. White and black, again, digging the theme here, buddy, and good job with all the color matching. That Dell U3415W is a nice and large 34 inch ultra wide screen. And for the peripherals, we have the Thermaltake Poseidon Z RGB gaming keyboard, the Logitech G400S gaming mouse, and a pair of Bayer Dynamic DT770 Pro headphones. Now, onto that PC, inside the Corsair Air 540 ATX case, we have an i5 4690K. 16 gigabytes of Corsair Vengeance RAM, and the MSI GTX 980 Ti graphics card. An all around, very nice setup that uses desk space efficiently and stays true to being minimalistic. And just when you thought I was only including ultra wides, nope, you're wrong. This setup is a great showcase of simplicity and productivity that works for him and his YouTube channel. His desk is an IKEA creation with the, uh, the shelf there as well in which he is propping up his monitor and that desk gives him tons of space since it is so large. IKEA desks are very popular amongst the community I can see. In the middle there is his Dell 2405 FPW monitor, which he states is admittedly outdated, but hey, it gets the job done, right? Next to those are the JBL Pebble speakers, nice and modern looking with a low profile that provide great sound quality. And then next to that is those little fake IKEA plants to add some color. I'm really liking the addition of plants in these setups, guys. That was one of my tips in my improving your setup video, so good stuff. As for his peripherals, gotta go with the productivity, so the Logitech MX Masters mouse is the way to go, and the Logitech K360 keyboard, both wireless to avoid clutter, and they connect to his Dell laptop via one single receiver. Yes, his entire setup is run by his laptop, which gives him a nice simple setup at home, and he can take it with him on the go for school and stuff like that. I like this, nothing too crazy over the top, but it's simple and it works for him, and that's all that matters.